you're fucking out. <laughs> y'all tiny vegan mom here and today I wanted to talk to you guys about something that happened to me yesterday so story time okay so yesterday was this family thing for that that Cody family has and a woman came there you know everything was all good Stephen was there everyone was happy chilling hanging out and this woman comes there well she um she brought her vegan grandkids. She's not vegan. And she brought her vegan grandkids. And she was letting them eat meat and dairy. And y'all, this is like my worst fear with people babysitting Steven or anything like that. It's like... Oh. <laughs> it's uh it's it sucks it it makes you really want to think so anyways so she was there and you know she was uh letting her kids eat like the food there that wasn't vegan and she said what mama doesn't know won't kill her <laughs> y'all i about fucking lost it lost it like my face <laughs> my face turned red and you know I I I didn't want to ruin everybody's good time at the party so I went inside and I stayed inside until she left because that's how mad I was I already have a very very hard time leaving Steven with anyone and let me just go ahead and say this. If anyone ever tries to feed my child meat or dairy or any animal byproducts after knowing our lifestyle and knowing the moral reasons why we do not feed him that stuff, I'll either beat the living shit out of them or they will never see my child again, including his grandparents. If my, my mom or my husband's mom or anyone anyone ever did that and I found out about it that that's it you're done you're you are out and there, there's probably no coming back from it like that's how strongly I feel about being vegan now um I just I cannot when I heard that when I heard what mama doesn't know won't kill her like yeah I was so upset like and then to be like it's just so expensive to be vegan Listen the fuck up, okay? Let me tell you something right now. It is not expensive to be vegan. Not only is it healthier for you, not only are you saving millions of fucking animals, you're helping your fucking child grow up to be a morally better person. And you're helping the fucking animals that you, you supposedly love and cherish. You're helping them. It's not expensive. Of course, obviously, the vegan junk food, yeah, it might be a little bit more expensive. But you don't have to give your fucking child junk food all the time. Fruits, vegetables, starches, fucking rice and potatoes. Mix that shit up. Make it fucking taste good. Add some fucking broccoli. Add some shit to your simple food. And I promise you, it is not expensive. Not everyone lives this vegan couture life. Like, like, I'm sorry. And if you have the money to buy expensive clothes, but you want to say that being vegan is fucking expensive, you just need to get smacked. Smacked right across your stupid ass fucking face. That's the most ridiculous shit I've ever heard in my entire life. Ever. <laughs> this is new. This is Steven's new favorite thing. Um... Obviously, I've super washed it and cleaned it, but he loves this thing. I can't can't get him to get away from it. It's weird. But, anyways. So, um, I can't express, like, well, obviously, I am expressing how upsetting that was to me to hear that come from a grandmother of children that she says she loves, but she can't respect their lifestyle. What? <laughs> so, anyways, um... This, 
this is why I need more vegan mom friends where I'm at right now and people I can relate to because I, I it's a fear and it sucks that I have to fear that someone's going to fuck up or not give a hell not care and and mess that up like it's not only are like we fighting against the stigma of ve veganism as it is like raising vegan children but to top it off with like people doing that and not respecting it so it's not like um it's not like i'm breaking him of anything i'm i'm keeping him from me and i hate when people say that i hate when people are like oh i can't believe you're gonna keep this and this and this from him like I can't believe you're letting your child eat a decaying carcass, but that's none of my business. So, I usually keep my mouth shut on stuff like that. But, you know, I had to walk away. I cannot, I cannot deal with shit like that. Anyways, again, um, this is just like a little rant video. Let me know how you feel about this. If this were to happen to your child, I want to know what you would do. How you would handle it. Because if it ever happens... I've, I'll probably go like my I'll probably go blank and I'll wake up and not know what happened because that's how angry I'll be but please please if you watch this video let me know how you feel about this just let me know um thank you for like subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet please like subscribe to my channel and go vegan and have a great day and tiny vegan mom baby Steven saying bye